Hi guys, here we are again. Um, it's Harry from the Motor Yacht Department here at Berthen. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you over Fasalia 2. Uh, she is a Windy 31 Zonda. Let's jump aboard. Hi guys, here we are, Fasalia 2. She's finished in this stunning metallic hull in the ice blue, they call it. Just gonna look from the other side. She's a personal favorite of the range of mine. Plenty of space for me, the ultimate day boat, really. Just looking back, so we've got teak laid on the bathing platform and throughout in the cockpit. Just the bathing ladder that you saw just then. Looking back over the upholstery, she's finished in the classic blue umbrella. Underneath here, really useful fender storage basket. She fits four large fenders in there, and there's plenty more storage underneath the seating for the rest. Just arrived in from Corfu, still in her first ownership. This backrest is classic windy, obviously it reverts right back to the stern and then creates a bigger bed, or you can have it as a seating area here in the cockpit. Just taking the cover off this table, still in near new condition, as you can see. She's been really well maintained, and that just turns around to just create a bigger space for dining. So she's a 2014 model. Like I say, she's still in her first ownership. And was originally purchased in the UK, went to Corfu, and has just arrived back with us two months ago. Just looking over our plotters and our nav gear here. She fits with a Raymarine C127 chart plotter and a I70 log and depth. You've got a Bennett trim tabs there, twin throttle controls, your Volvo management computers, just see the hours there. And this anti-glare material is just fantastic when you're cruising along on a bright sunny day. So she has a large deck fridge here. I'm just gonna show you good size fridge for when out with the family or friends. Keep everything cool. And I'm just gonna show you the engines here. She is powered by twin D3220s, just been serviced. The legs have just been serviced too, so she is turnkey ready. And this table, as you can see, actually stores on top of the hatch there. Um, I don't know if you can see, but yeah, yeah, so it all stores neatly away. Put a hot water tank down there, you've got your battery banks down there. Plenty of room to work on the engines if needs be. Nice clean bilges. Yeah, really been well looked after this boat. Lots of insulation, so it's just, it's just once that hatch is closed, just no noise at all. A very smooth operating boat. Here you have all the rocker switches. Obviously, I lifted up the hatch from this panel. Down there, you've got the VHF and your fusion sound system with four speakers throughout the cockpit. And there's a couple of speakers down below as well, which I'll show you after I've shown you the fore deck. So we've got this great access straight through the screen, straight onto the deck. She's not fitted with the front cushions, however you can have those fitted if needs be. So we've got the electrics and the spare battery and breaker for the bow thruster in this locker. Moving along, other side you have the chain locker and spare warp storage and then you have your Lumar windlass with your integrated anchor system. It's very neat and tidy. Just looking back over the boat, just give you more of an idea of your seating. It's a very sociable boat, even when just cruising with a, a friend or a partner, can be sat right next to you just cruising along. Okay, let's go down and have a look at the accommodation. Got this lovely worktop on the port side with the electric symmetric hob. Got all windy branded crockery and glassware. Looking over, you've got a double berth and some storage underneath. Again, we've got plenty of light coming into the cabin here. 
and some hanging lockers as well. Just gonna have a little look in the heads here. So you've got electric flushing heads in here, sink and a vanity unit. We've also got this pull-out shower. It's very useful if, if you're staying on board for the weekend. Uh, you've got all the facilities that you need. Just coming back out. All this teak in really great condition. And there we are, that's Vesalia 2. Please do not hesitate to give us a call for a viewing or some more details. Thank you.